In lesson 17, we're going to start right away with another independence exercise. You are only going to play single independent strokes, and the tonality will get a little strange as those notes tend to be a seventh apart sometimes. Don't let that throw you. It follows a very easy stepwise motion. The left hand starts the ascending three note scale and the right hand plays the exact same thing a beat behind. You will hit on beat two together, both single independents together. Make sure that doesn't flam. Other than that, this is a fairly simple exercise. Since this is primarily an independence exercise, we didn't incorporate the manual in print. However, this would be an easy one to take to a scale you're familiar with that does incorporate the upper manual. You still want to make sure that you're not hitting flams when they hit together, and you want to make sure that your rhythm is correct so that the right hand is following a beat behind the left hand. I'll give you an example of this in D major. Now you'll see a little bit more movement between the manuals. When I played that in D major, you'll notice that I didn't do as much shifting because my hands were doing separate things. I really had to work on that concept of the push and the pull at different times to make this exercise work. So this one is not so much about the body shifting, but rather moving around the manuals at a different rate. <laughs> 